In this guide, we'll delve into Mantra's workspace concept and demonstrate how to handle them efficiently. Mantra's workspaces offer a unique approach to structuring your intranet, segmenting it based on business locations or subsidiaries. As a user, navigating and switching between workspaces is seamless. Simply click on the Action button, followed by Workspaces. This displays the workspaces available to me. Let's explore a few. Observe that each workspace boasts distinct branding and content, including news, events, links, posts, and beyond, ensuring a tailored user experience. To manage your workspaces, head straight to Mantra's administration. Once you're there, you'll be greeted by the Workspaces tab, showcasing all the workspaces you've established. Every workspace is uniquely named with an option for further personalization. Keen on creating a new workspace? Just click on the Add Workspace button. Enter the name you prefer. And remember, you can always change this later. If your goal is to determine the visibility of certain workspaces to specific users, our personalization function is your go-to. Choose Add Condition. These conditions can be linked to a Confluence group or Mantra Profile attributes. Start by inputting a group name and pick the right match from the drop-down. For another condition, let's tap into the Mantra profile. The drop-down menu will present all associated Mantra profile fields, particularly those that are single or multi-select. Select the suitable field and its corresponding choices. We are allowed to define up to three conditions for a single workspace. Don't forget to save your changes. When you wish to modify certain aspects of a workspace, like its design or news feed, turn to the sidebar. Ensure that the correct workspace is active and then hit Settings. This will only modify the active workspace. And if you're more of a visual learner, don't miss our video tutorial on this topic. That concludes our journey through Mantra's workspaces for now. Catch you in the next guide.